Okay, it looks like I'm live. I don't actually know if I'm fucking live or not. You guys are typing. So I'm gonna assume that, yeah, we're good. Um, but the thing didn't want to update for me. And uh, it came up and was like, hey, we couldn't grab the proper information. And don't I was- bingo, blango, Don't bingo, Don't bingo, fucking don't. Thank you for the reminder about the fucking volume. Thank you, ASJ, you bitch ass motherfucker. Um, but yeah, it says, it says I'm live. Oh, you can't see me. Hold on, everybody. I got to go into my fake Discord server. Hold on. You can't even see me. I'm not even really here. Who knows? Who knows what's happening today? This fucking, I broke, I fucking broke my setup. Okay. I don't, I don't know what's happening. I broke my fucking setup. I don't know if I'm live. I'm fucking, uh, I don't, I don't fucking know. I don't know. Anyway, um, hi, welcome to stream. Um, sorry, I just got all fucky wuckied in the, in the sideways because I don't even know if I'm live or anything. I don't even know if it has a name on this stream or anything. Can anybody check to see if I have a title? I mean, obviously I'm getting bingle bangled, so it's not like, like fucking Twitch banned me yet that I know of. They might have. I don't fucking know. Um, no, it still says everything. Okay, it still says my end fucking i don't know it says that it's still working okay cool thanks everybody i don't know what the fuck the problem was i came up and it was like yeah we can't verify your twitch and i was like uh fucking what and it was like yeah we can't verify your twitch you can try again or you can just go live and of course me i was like yeah just just go live and, or I was like, try again. And it was like, mm, nope, idiot, too bad. And I was like, okay, try again. And it was like, mm, no, we don't know. And so I signed out and I signed back in. And I was like, would that fix it? And it's like, mm, nope, you're a fucking idiot. And I was like, all right, I guess just go live. So here we are, I guess. Hello, everybody. Anyway, how the fuck are you all? Hopefully you're fucking dope as hell and um and 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 not fucking stressed out about the fact that it was just like no idiot you can't get on twitch uh, <laughs> i'm here now anyway that's what matters i'm like fucking walking into to to class seven seven minutes late ready to bingo don't fucking bingo me um seven minutes late with a starbucks there's so many takuna ones popping up i gotta change the fucking Bingle bangles, because we recorded like 20 new ones. Actually, it's like more like 25. Anyway, we recorded a significant amount of new ones, and they're not coming up. All I keep hearing in my ear is fucking Takuno. So I'm going to have to change that. Anyway, um, let me welcome everybody to the fucking chat. Um, Hello, Ryura. Hello, Kakashi Lover. Hello, Rhett Rogue. Uh, hello, Wilkins. Hello, Cro Closet Brony. Hello, Labyrinths. Hello, Sour Lad. Hello, ASJ. Hello, Grey Ga Graves. G God, I almost always call you Gay G Gaves. I'm sorry. Uh, hello, Tonto. Uh, hello, Trail Mix. Hello, Nocturnal Blade. Hello, Vanessa. Hello, Small E. Um... Hello, Miles. There we go. There we go. We did it. We did it. We got everybody. Huh. So I see redemptions coming in, but they're not, like, coming to me. Which is weird. I will refund your point slice of coffee because I'm not hearing the fake bingle bangle. I don't... Hmm... Hello, today on Toxic Ear Streams, Wazzy breaks fucking Twitch. Hi, everybody. It's me, ya boy, Wazzy. I have broken Twitch. Um, fuck me sideways. All right, well. Bingo, bingo. Okay, well, okay, there's a bingo bingo. Okay, all right. Well, Kakashi Lover gave me a hydrate. Any of the noise ones, I will refund your points for those slice of coffee. Um, also, welcome to the stream. <laughs> Smalley says, we demand entertainment. I'm trying out here. I'm trying, but are you surprised I fucking broke Twitch? No, of course you're not. It's me. What did you expect from me? Did you fucking expect to come to this stream and be like, ah, yes, everything will work according to Keikaku? Of course not everything's going to work fucking according to Keikaku. I'm alone. I'm alone in the house and everything's catching on fire. 
I don't know if that's true or not. I haven't been downstairs in a hot minute. Um, but, but, but still. Oh, was this the distance I was? Oh, it was. Okay, cool. I got all fucked up here. I'm trying to work on Patreon requests and I'm getting fucked up. Basically, my Patreon request right now is, um, is... Optimus Prime if he was Amazon Prime. And that's the that's what I'm working on, if you must know. Uh, anyway, we would like a fact. Tonto would like a fact. And I am just the kind of guy to give you a fact. Ahem. Did you know a 10-year-old mattress weighs two times its original weight? Which means... All your dead skin cells and bugs and shit live in your mattress, which makes your mattress heavier. There's your fucking cursed fact of the day. You guys want to bring me dead fucking birds? I'll give you a dead bird. Your mattress has so much dead skin in it, it's it's now heavier than it once was. There you go. Fuck you. Anyway, Red says, hey, did you know Simpsons did a Halloween parody of Death Note called Death Tome? Um, yes, I did know this. They're about 10 years too late. And also, um, a fun fact, um, I haven't watched it yet, but I was like, I wonder if Fox owns Death Note now, and that's why they're able to get away with this. <laughs> ASJ says, make with the funnies. No, I can't. ASJ, ASJ, I'm fucking, I'm literally here breaking shit. You fucking, you fucking think I'm, I'm the cool kind of guy that's got somebody in the background who's able to come fix my shit? I, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not a professional streamer. We know this. This is my job. This is my fucking job, but I am not a professional streamer. I'm like, I'm like when you fucking, you go to the Starbucks and you're like, ah, time to get some coffee made by coffee professionals. I'm like the new guy. I'm the new guy wearing the little, the little badge on there that says trainee on it. They have my name spelled wrong. I've got like seven buttons on me. And like, there's some very annoyed back guy in the background, just like uh, watching over me. And I'm like, ah, here's your fucking half frap mocha latte with, with soy and you're like mm, I asked for goat milk and you smash it out of my hand and it falls on the ground that's what's happening right now that's what happens right now I am I am the shitty trainee uh, even though this is my professional living <laughs> I, you know what's the funnest part is I sit here and I'm like, I'm not a professional. I don't know what I'm doing. And then Banani comes out and Banani's like, oh, actually, tomorrow's Banani's birthday. Um, but Banani comes out and Banani's like, I don't know how to do this. And I'm like, Psh, ha, noob, how do you not know how to do this? I am, I'm, I'm great at everything. Um, yeah. That's, that's me. Anyway, let's put the fire on because we're, no, it's too high. I'll take the fire off. Anyway, <laughs> that's, that's how I feel. Um, let me catch up. Crew, there's still 90 plus subs to give, to get, uh, to give an, to be given attack. Uh, that's just for the current one. Um, our, we made our next goal, our first goal. Our next goal is going to be a new sound alert is going to happen. Um, also sour lad, the sound alerts are not working. Um, so I will re return those. <laughs> um, is this some sort of box gun? Awesome. You're all alone. Let's order an uncomfortable amount of frosties. Kakashi lover. No. Um, I see screenshots of death tome, but I don't know if I want to watch it yet. I want to watch it just cause I want to see what happens in it. And also I like Treehouse of terror. Listen, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sit here and tell you that Treehouse of Terror is the best um is the best Simpsons episodes of all time, but I am gonna heavily imply it. Um Kakashi says, when you die you get cremated, uh your family can put your ashes in an hourglass. Uh, oh, I don't want that. I've decided I've decided I don't want that. I don't, I don't want that. <laughs> Was the unpaid intern streamer? I am unpaid intern streamer. I am, I am, I'm the fucking streamer that's going to go get all the other cooler streamers coffee. 
People that know what they're doing. Ramen. Ramen is like, Wazzy, go get me a fucking coffee. And I have to go, ah, okay. Even though he's been streaming less than me, he's more accomplished at it than me. <laughs> Red says, hey, Wazzy, have you heard of the anime No Guns Life? It's like Chainsaw Man, but the main guy has a gun for a head. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> Renessa says, that example was oddly specific. Wazzy, do you want to talk about your barista-based trauma? Uh, yes, Renessa, I do want to talk about my barista-based trauma. Are you guys ready to hear about all my experiences when I was a Starbucks barista? And all my experiences with Starbucks? Um, so once upon a time, I, um, I, I, got, I got to preface this, actually. Um, I have to preface this with, I have never worked at a Starbucks. I have never, I've never worked at a coffee place. However, I came to the town I'm living in now and I didn't have a job. And I was like, I'm going to go around and give out resumes and get a job. Um, cause it was like 2010s and you could get a job like nobody's business. A recession hadn't hit yet. So it was, it was a good time. It's a good time to go around and like hand out resumes, especially in retail, because it was like 2010 and nobody knew what a recession was yet. Um, we were just at the, at the crust of a recession about to happen. Anyway, um, I went into a Starbucks and I was like, I'm going to hand in my resume. And I go into a Starbucks and I listen to this woman just rattle off the most complicated thing I've ever heard. And I don't even like coffee. I guess I should also state that. Um, I don't even like coffee. And I just listened to this customer rattle off the most complicated drink order I've ever heard. And I was just like, in reality, it was probably nothing too big. It was probably like, just like, yes, can I get like a, a no frap, um, chocolate with, 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 with goat milk or something. And, um, I don't, I don't know what it was. Um, but like, either way, it did bad. Literally, this woman explains this fucking thing. And I'm standing there in line with my resume. And I literally was just like, I am never going to be able to get a hold of this. And I just quickly turned and walked directly out of the Starbucks. And uh, that's that's my experience of working at Starbucks when I didn't really work at Starbucks. I just walked in. <laughs> I just walked in with a resume and was like, I'm going to work at Starbucks. And then somebody ordered something complicated. And I went, fucking nope. <laughs> And that's, and that's the story. <laughs> um, well, he's no longer 2001. You are old now. I know this. <laughs> Fun fact, the United States reason uh, for any evidence was found from a legal cannot be used in court of law because the Ohio, uh, in Ohio, because police illegally searched the house of someone with a fake warrant, found a box of warrant, which was illegal to own, and the case went to the Supreme Court. And yes, this is the reason why any evidence used in a court of law, the police have to find it through legal search warrant. Thanks, small E. ASG says, it's Treehouse of Horror, you philosophe. Listen, Treehouse of Terror sounds better because I like the two T's together. Trail Mix says, new sound alerts. I suddenly feel the idea to spend a not wise amount of money on this stream. Don't you do it. I'm working today. We are working today, Trail Mix. Trail Mixist. Mix of trails. Uh, Kakashi says, there's a dead bird of information for the day. Thanks. Thanks, you guys. Trail Mix says, wasn't there a huge recession in 2008? I don't know when the recession was. It might have been 2008. I don't know. I don't know when I was here. I don't know when I lived here. Um, Closet Brody says, did the drink order sound like a spell incantation? I can't even remember. I just remember walking in and it sounded so fucking complicated. And I was like, nah, I ain't doing this. <laughs> no, no, this ain't for me. This Starbucks life just fucking, this ain't for me, man. <laughs> the, the bubble base of coffee. <laughs> Uh, I don't like coffee. I just uh, like what it does to my body. Listen, either way, I'm just saying that when I moved out, there was a there, it was really easy to get a job, except it took me months to get a job. But it seemed real easy at the time. And I worked in retail and I worked in an edgy. This will be a surprise to everybody. Um, so when I... The first job I ever had, um, as you know, I worked in the theater in my hometown. 
Um, that's the haunted ass theater I've talked about before. Um, but when I moved here, I worked in retail and I worked in a retail store and, uh, it was a very edgy retail store. And I'm going to say the name of it because you guys will understand me when I say this. I worked at Spencer's Gifts and those of you that are my, um, Amer non North American cohorts, just imagine like the edgiest store think of think of oh they don't have hot topic either um think of a store you could go in and buy wallets on a chain but also dildos and also and also uh, anime merch at the same time it, it's like it's like hot topic if hot topic was shittier like imagine Imagine a hot topic, and then imagine hot. To somebody was like, "Ha! Hot topics, a bunch of posers. We could be better." And then was infinitely shittier. Just imagine that, and that was my first job in the town I live in now. And I walked in there, and they gave me a job. And this is how much they suck. Me, remember, this is me. This is how much they suck. I walk in there. Within a month, I was a key holder. They were like, yeah, we'll give you keys. You can open and close the building. Yeah, whatever. We don't give a shit. So, yeah. Imagine imagine Hot Topic. Somebody thought Hot Topic was a poser and decided to be shittier. <laughs> yeah, it was it was great. <laughs> Kakashi says, I'm so sorry you had to work there. <laughs> Slice of Coffee says, we have Hot Topic. Colossal Brody says, oh gosh, that store. Greg Graves looks to the side. <laughs> Travick says, we do not have a store like that anywhere here. Kakashi told me my mom, um, or says, my mom said, would not let me go into that store. They had so much anime stuff that I wanted. <laughs> it's Hot Topic with sex stuff. North America has those and Hot Topic. Yeah, we had... We had, um, it was Spencer's, it's Spencer's gift. If you guys have ever heard the Spirit Halloween, uh, shops, Spirit Halloween is actually run by Spencer's gifts. Um, they, they are the ones you guys, you guys have seen the memes of like, oh, this building's closed down. Here's now a, a Spirit Halloween store. That's, they're run by Spencer's gifts, actually. Fun, fun fact for y'all. Um, but yeah, I worked there. Um, and then I got a whole bunch of people employed there and then I quit because they didn't pay well. And I got a job that gave me more money. Uh -huh. Too bad Hot Topic has gotten worse over the years. I mean, that's also true. Chill Mix says, we have two type of clothing stores, big brand shops and thrift shops. Oh. Um, well, imagine... Imagine a thrift shop. Well, it's not a thrift shop at all. Imagine a big brand store was edgy and small. Just, just trust me on this. Just trust me. Do I got to bring up pictures? We're working today. I can't even, I'm not bringing you guys up examples. Fuck you. Imagine. Close your eyes and imagine. Imagination time with Wazi. Okay, everybody. We're doing imagination time with Wazi. Imagine. Close your eyes. And think of a big titty goth girlfriend now imagine your big titty goth girlfriend is 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 kind of shitty she's she's not she's not the nicest to you she like never has any money um she, she's giving you like she's she she, she 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 cheated on you a couple of times um she's she doesn't cut her toenails and like, um, like she's just, she's just generally not the greatest, but she's trying, but she's still got big titties and is a goth girlfriend. That's Spencer's gifts. That's Spencer's gifts as a girlfriend. It's, it's not great. <laughs> uh, Kakashi Lover says, of course they ran uh, by that store. Why wouldn't they be? <laughs> Glass of Brody says, done. Also, sour like keep me hydrate. Thank you. And says, drink your medical Gatorade. How did you know I'm drinking my medical Gatorade? I woke up with every symptom of my pill this morning. I want you guys to know that. This pill has an uncomfortable amount of side effects. And I woke up with every single one of them. 
which was headache, hand numbness, dizziness, blurry vision, and um, and also being really tired and also having to pee. <laughs> I was so ready. I woke up and I was so ready. So ready to start my day. And I woke up and I was like, oh, I wish for death. I hate that when you're like, oh, yay, new pills. And then all the side effects are worse than the actual thing you're trying to stop. It's like, yeah, this this pill will make it so that, you know, your eyes don't bleed anymore. And you're like, wow, I need that. My eyes bleed all the time. And then you get this pill so that your eyes don't bleed all the time. And like one of the side effects is like may cause sudden instant heart failure. And you're like, hmm, is this really... Is this really worth what it's trying to fix? <laughs> um, Grave says, imagine what you think a 70-year-old man would think uh, to sell to anime fans. <laughs> I can't imagine a 70-year-old man knowing what anime is because when I think of a 70-year-old man, I just think of my grandpa and he 100% did not know what anime was. Although he did take me to the store and let me buy bootleg Pokemon cards, so. I mean, grandpas are like that. At least my grandpa was like that. My grandpa would take me to the store and be like, here's here's money, go buy bootleg Pokemon cards. And you're like, thanks, grandpa. My grandpa also took me to the Pokemon movie because my mom didn't want to. My mom was like, I am not fucking going to another fucking Pokemon. I'm not going to another Pokemon movie. I'm, no, fuck you. I'm not going to the Pokemon movie. The Pokemon movie 2000, I might add. And I was like, but mom, it's Pokemon movie. I gotta go to the Pokemon movie. And she was like, no, you're not going to the Pokemon movie. And then my grandpa was like, I'll take her to the Pokemon movie. And then he took me to the Pokemon movie. And then he made me, he took me to a restaurant. And he, the whole reason he took me to the restaurant was so that uh, there was VLTs there and he could gamble. So <laughs> that's, that, and, and that was me and grandpa hanging out. <laughs> um. Wazzy's well, just sharing her fantasy. It's just says, uh, Dr. Wazzy's Toxic Cure, the miracle decalcifying 100% authentic Gatorade. Well, the miracle decalcifying 100% authentic Hello, hello there. Are you tired of pissing your own skeleton? Try new, new and improved Gatorade Zero Fruit Savage. That's the French side. Berry. <laughs> Did you know berry in French is fruit savage? I'm not even fucking kidding you. It's fruit savage. Oh, French people. Uh, Miles says, yeah, I have a Spencer's near me. It's literally just post uh, corner uh, generic candy, other weeb emo stuff, but it uh, the back third is all literal um, alley-shaped hole in the wall with all the sex stuff and the beer funnels and shit like that. That's true. That's exactly it, Miles. And I worked there. And they and they let me hold a key to that place. This should this should come into as a surprise to no one, but um that location isn't there anymore, and I might have been part of the cause of that. I don't know for sure. <laughs> Jesus, why um this is why you should solve all your problems with an axe. Dorito Dragon says, Wazzy, I got a question. Have you ever been to a party? Yeah, I've been to a party. I go to lots of parties. You guys saying I'm a nerd? I'm sorry. Do you think I'm a nerd? I haven't been to like a college frat boy party. I was like usually a party host, not like a usual. Like in, in my 20s, I was like usually like early 20s. I was like the one who had the parties at my house because I was the only one who had a place to crash. Um... So most of the parties were held at my place. Um, but now I still go to parties. Um, they're just at my friend's houses usually because I don't like cleaning up after people. This is a pro tip, everybody. If you're like, hey, I wanna <laughs> I wanna I wanna have cool parties and have cool friends. Guess what? Have parties, but have them at other people's houses so that you don't have to clean up after. Trust me, it's a fucking pro tip and it'll save your life one day. Oh, damn it. Why did I zoom out? Oh, I suck so much. No, no. Stop zooming out, you bitch. There we go. We figured it out. Um, 
<laughs> you say that, but the 70-year-old man who beats the shit out of me in Yu-Gi-Oh begs to differ. <laughs> Trailix says, French is a silly little language. It is. It's just says, Solomon Muto say, takes no prisoners. <laughs> Trailix says, Wazi, there's nothing I believe in more than you being a nerd. No, seriously. I go to parties now. I bring deviled eggs. Every party I go to is a potluck, and I'm the person that brings deviled eggs. I'm really good at making deviled eggs, crew. This is something you would not know about me, but I'm actually really good at making deviled eggs. And everybody, every time I go to a party, everybody's like, bring them fucking deviled eggs. And I'm the only dude who has the decency and the time of day to fucking make the deviled eggs to bring them. So I'm the deviled egg dude, and I'm okay with that. And when I don't bring deviled eggs to a party, I bring a fucking tray of meats that I pick up from the grocery store. Bring things to parties, people. In fact, I was at a Halloween party, and that's where I shoved all that candy inside Zephyrine's hood. In his stupid Kylo Ren costume. That's right. I went to a pull I went to a party and I bullied someone. That's how much of a non-nerd I am. <laughs> I went to a party. I had a whole bunch of uh berry of um what are they called? Fuzzy peaches. Fuzzy peaches. And I crammed them in Zephyrine's hood because he was dressed as Kylo Ren and he had the unfortunate um situation of being in front of me while I had fucking fuzzy peaches in my hand. I keep wanting to say Swedish berries, but it 100% was not Swedish berries. Because I would have eaten the Swedish berries. I like Swedish berries. Uh, Dorito Dragon says, no, no, I was just wondering if you've ever been to a party with booze, because tomorrow I'm going to a party with booze and I don't know what to expect. Here, I'll tell you what to expect if you go to a party with booze. Booze. You, you if you're going to a party with booze, expect booze to be there. I, I don't know. Listen, I'm gonna be hundred percent honest. If it's anything like my parties, you sit around and you eat and you drink and you talk. That's what that's what people do at parties. And sometimes they play music and you're like, damn, this music sucks. I wish you'd play better music. And then they pick something and they're like, Wazzy, you'll love this. And then they play some song that you've never heard of before. And it sucks major ass. And you got to sit there and look this dude in the face and be like, oh, yeah, thanks for changing the music for me. And that's it. And that's and that's your that's that's a party. That's a party with drinking. <laughs> Was he on board? Do you rant about Pinterest and pickles? No, I don't want to. Ace Jesus says, expect people to make idiots of themselves. Don't drink too much on your own and remember other people's regrets rather than making your own. That is good advice, ASJ. Damn, ASJ, coming in here with good advice for a change? What the fuck? That sounds fake. Who, who the fuck are you? What did you do to ASJ? <laughs> what the fuck? What the absolute fuck? <laughs> Um, so instead of Wazzy, you're eggsy? <laughs> no, I just, I bring the eggs. I br That's my job. That's my job. Fucking, a party happens, and I'm like, I'll bring deviled, or I'm like, I'll bring this. And somebody goes, are you going to bring deviled eggs? And I go, shit, I mean, I guess. And they go, all right, cool, Wazzy's bringing the deviled eggs, everybody. And then I got to bring the fucking deviled eggs. Listen, here's here's my advice, everybody. Don't get good at making a thing. If you get really good at making a thing and you go hang out with your friends and, like, they know you're good. Like, let's say cupcakes. Let's say you're fucking dope ass at making cupcakes. Let's say you make, like, you're fucking, you're, you're out there. You're, like, fucking, like, a champion of icing and shit. You're, like, the best cupcake maker in the world. Don't fucking tell anybody. Don't fucking tell anybody. Especially not if you go to parties. Because then everybody's going to be like, I was coming to the party. You should, you should bring the cupcakes. You bring, the, bring the cupcakes to the party. You don't want to be that guy. You don't want to be the guy that has to bring the cupcakes all the fucking time. Don't tell anyone you're good at anything ever. Listen, learn to be a shitty little guy. Learn to be crew. What you need to do is learn to be shitty. Oh, there we go. Now I'm getting the bogs and shit in. What the fuck, tits? Listen, learn 
Learn to be just a shitty little guy. This is the best advice I have for you. I Listen, I was telling you guys yesterday about how I don't cook my own meals. That's because I learned to be a shitty little guy. I learned to suck early in life. The earlier you s- suck, the sooner people will not expect things. And then you could just, like, go about your life, okay? The less people expect from you, the fucking better. The fucking better it is. <laughs> This is like the worst advice I'm ever giving. This is, this is, don't actually follow this shit. Listen. <laughs> Jado Dragon says, I've never been to an adult party, so I'm nervous. Um, oh, wait, I forgot. I got to get songs to recommend. Listen, the only song you should recommend is Seabat. Um, Trail Mix says, if you're going to a party with booze, ex- expect people to make bad decisions. Three, four, better bangle the door. Ah! 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 Bagels are happening. Here they go. I hear them. Pine cone. Pine cone. Pine cone. Pine cone. Can you proceed to jail? Why would you do that? Pine cone. Pinecone, I have strong words for you. Pinecone, what the fuck? We're in the middle. We Pinecone, we are in the middle of shit here. Pinecone, we are in the middle of talking about how cool I am at parties. Why would you do this to me? Why would you fucking do this to me on this day of my birth? The bingo rules. Oh my god, finally a new bingle. I'm so happy. Um, <laughs> fuck you. Fuck you. Okay, listen, crew. I'm so mad. Bingle, bangle. God damn it, I'm so mad. <sighs> Ryura, thank you for re- re- gifting subs. Listen, the thing can't even keep up. Oh, God, crew. You're going to jail. Anyway. God, let me catch up on chat after that. One. Welcome our new oh, bingle God. Overlords. Crew, crew, crew. Crew, please, please. I'm just, I'm just a little guy. We're gonna stop this. Also, that's incredibly wrong. The crew member count is now incredibly wrong because it only counted ten of those. It only counted eleven of those, and there was like twenty something. God, fucking damn it, crew! You unlocked another thing, and I don't know what it is, and I'm kind of scared to look. Christ Almighty! Christ Waffles! We started. Okay, we started with a hundred and ten. Which was... Oh, Christ, that means a new sound emote has to go in. Fuck me! What What do you guys want for a new sound? Bingle, bingle me, please. Oh, God, stop bingling me! Stop it! This is a work stream! We are a professional business office! This is motherfucking Wazzy's Inc! This is fucking... We are business people here! We are trying to do... Get me some bingle bangles! We are (laughs) trying to do our job! Do you not see me trying to drop a box Optimus Prime? Do you fucking... We are... We are fucking working here! Fuck! Bingle, bangle. I gotta now count. I gotta now count. I gotta now do an uncomfortable... Okay. Pinecone gifted 20... Pinecone, I think you're close to a takeover, actually. Uh, we're probably gonna have to discuss that, because I think you're close to um, a toxic takeover. Um, which is unfortunate for me. And then Ryura gifted to... So we uh, have that now to deal with, and I will update it later. Because if we started with that, that means we're at 132, technically. Oh, God. Okay, let me fucking catch up on chat! Let me... Let me fucking catch up. Let me fucking attempt to catch up on chat. Okay. Where the fuck was I? I don't even know where I was in chat anymore! I don't even know anymore! Fuck me. I've lost it. I've lost it. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sorry, everybody. Okay, quick. I'm going to uh, fucking read fast. Um, can you draw Among Us in the new Sonic game? Uh, don't get good at making a thing. Finally, some advice I can follow. Dude, I love being to be the deviled egg guy. I walk in and I'm like, I'm the deviled egg guy, motherfucker. <laughs> Renessa says, I know how to make a good spaghetti. Oh, yeah. Um, bingo, bongo. I have all the time. God damn it, stop bingling me! Um... <laughs> 
Uh, quotes, quotes, quotes. Fucking getting pickle pickles. Okay, uh, Pie Cut says, I just got here. Uh, fucking, uh, fucking Onion Circus and, and, and fucking Ryura. Um, uh, f- fucking Bigel Bagley me. Um, fucking, uh, Pie Coat says, smiley face, bitch. Um, Core Break says, Sea Bad is a song claimed to be the only one to fuck to. <laughs> they gifted 22, but the goal uh, only added half of them. I know. I don't know why. Um, Dorito Dragon says, by the way, I'm going to look through my songs. That's how good for a party. Um, Wazzy, you want that after I get back? Yeah, give put Sea Bad in there. And apparently I have a swear timer now. <laughs> I'm thrown off my groove. You threw off my groove. I hope you feel better. Pico says, a what? And Dorito Dragon says, what's a toxic takeover? Let me tell you, when you gift 100 subs over your lifetime, every time you gift 100 subs. So, like, that's that's an uncomfortable amount of money. That's like, that's like paying, like, an uncomfortable amount of money. You have to realize, 100 subs, I get, like, that's like paying $250 to me. Like, 100 subs gets me $250, essentially. Um, that's why it's so wild. Um, so, um, when you when, whenever you get to 100 subs gifted, you get to take over a stream. Which means um, you pick a stream. What is a bingle? A miserable little pile of bangles. Don't bingle me. And you take, you take it over. You pick any stream you want. And you come in, and you join me on a call, and we play whatever game you want. Um, you get your own little icon. You know how my icon is talking? You get a little extra oh, look at icon. Sub. Oh, God damn it, Matt. Get out of here. Get the fuck out of here, Matt. Uh, <laughs> um, you get a little you get a little talky guy, um, like my little talky guy, and you get your own custom border, and we do a stream together. And you get two hours of, of streaming. Make Bingle rue the day that it thought he could give Cave Johnson bangles. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's going to burn your house down with the bingles. <laughs> Thank you, Onion, for the new Bingle Bingle noise. I haven't got that one yet. That one's a comfortably loud. I'm going to have to edit that one's sound levels. Um, but yes, um, that's, um, that's a toxic takeover. Um, and... Yeah, when you gift 100 subs, you 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 take over. And if you're too uncomfortable and you're like, I don't want to take over, you still get to you still basically get to dictate what I do. If you're like, "Hey, I don't want to join you on a call, but I would it's like to tell you what to play." Bangle. I do that. Fuck off, Matt. Stop bingle bangling me. <laughs> oh, man. Rira says it sounds like fun. It we've had it with um with Potato is taken over and Dr. Cowbell is taken over, Raku's uncomfortably close to taking over, um, but I know what evil things he's thinking about and I don't want to do them, so I hope he doesn't. Um, Matt has taken over, technically, even though Matt lives here. <laughs> Was he 2000 to 6969, Death by Bingle Bangle? Anyway, Lion Tamer says, thank you for the Bingle Bangles. Uh, Lion Tamer says, guess who got the Scarlet Violet um, OLED? Now, uh, I'm on my way to work to grab my bag that I left last night. Well, have fun. I, man, I'm considering getting a new Switch just because, <laughs> um... Get bingled, idiot. Fuck. I did get bingled, idiot. Um, because... I have um, the Switch lights. Um, I don't know if you guys know this, um, but the Switch lights are just like, you don't have Joy-Cons, so they're just the one big thing put together, and they still have the screen and everything. So I have a Switch light. Um, and I am starting to get Joy-Con drift. But the unfortunate thing about the Switch light is that they're all attached. You can't get the fuck in there without breaking into fucking everything the Switch light has. So um, it's shitty! Uh, ramen has i think ramen has it ramen has just subscribed for a long ass time ramen has gifted a lot of subs but ramen's been here since like day one trader dragon says matt would you join me for a stream if i did a uh, toxic takeover why are you asking matt he's not even here i mean he is here but he's not live here I mean, Matt, if you're listening and you're for some reason done work and you want to come up here and talk into the microphone, you can. But what the fuck? You shouldn't be done. You're, you you have an hour, bitch. 
You're supposed to fucking be at work for an hour. Anyway, Dorito Dragon gave me a stretch. Nook Turtle says, wait, if Red Shirt Guy gives bingles and subs and he's married to Miss Wazzy, does the money just go back to him? Yes, essentially. Essentially, yes. Um, yes and no. Y yes and no. Essentially, he gives me money to pay for my own bills. <laughs> So essentially, essentially, what Matt's doing is being like, <laughs> he's he's just like, here you go, you little idiot. Have some money for your for your bills, you little idiot. Matt Matt pays for almost everything in this household. I just like to show up with like my fucking my barely any money a month and I'm like I have made this money and he goes good job Wazzy god damn it stop zooming out what fucking button am I pressing that's making it zoom out why is my fat ass arm touching the zoom out button I gotta save so I don't lose this this is an uncomfortable amount of box lines this is the worst art I've ever done I hope you guys are looking at this and going like damn those are some straight lines Wazzy's so good at drawing straight lines and the truth is, I am really good at drawing straight lines. Actually, that's a lie. I'm using a ruler on my tablet. And that is my pro tip for you guys of the day. Did you know you could put a ruler on your tablet so that your lines look super straight? Also, apparently, I fucking swore. Do you not see the distress I'm in, guys? You're not going to cut me a break. You guys are not going to cut me a break. I just got bingled to hell. I just got bing I just got freaking bingled... All over my body. My entire body got bingled. Oh, a bangle? <gasps> bingle the bangle? <laughs> Thank you. That's another one of the new ones. I like that we're getting the new ones. Um, now I can hear them and make sure they're good. Um, but I'm just a little guy out here. Oh, God damn. Onion, please. You guys could cut me a break. Did you know that? Did you guys know that it is fully in your power to not narc? And not bingle me? Did you guys know that? Did you guys know you have the power to not bingle that? Did you guys know that? Did you know Did you know in your little Yu-Gi-Oh! Heart of the Cards? Did you know if you Yu-Gi-Oh!ed Heart of the Cards, you would find out you didn't have to bangle me and didn't have to narc on me? And you could give me a day? You could just you could just be nice to me for a day? Has it ever... We can't get it! Listen! Stop bingling! We cannot get another bingle train, okay? It's impossible. We can't bingle train this quickly after bingle training, okay? Listen! You can't re-bingle a bingle train, okay? The bingle train is left, okay? You can't, you can't re-bingle. All right, it's gone. It's gone. The happy fun time is gone. Happy fun time is gone forever. Oh, God, party horn. Bingle, bingle! Do, 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 Please, I'm a little guy trying to work. <laughs> anyway, let's catch back up. Corbrick says, Wazzy, I have a switch light too. Oh, dope, I have the green one. Um, Nocturnal says, wait, if we're... Oh, I read that one. Um, if you took over Wazzy's stream and I was in a game where there's three of us, uh, could play, I would join. <laughs> Matt says, no, the money goes to Wazzy. It's her money. <laughs> and I'm not done work yet. Nocturnal says, you heard her, crew. Slap a new Switch LOD on her throne and get it for her. No, no, that would be too much. That's too much. You guys already do too much to me. Look at the how much you're bingling me, okay? That's already too much. Listen, you were already sent me the gross ass chocolate, and I had to eat it. I had to eat some of it. It was terrible. Um. Anyway. Oh, you can't unbingle that bangle. God damn it, onion! Onion. <laughs> um. DVD Wing says, "Congrats on the subathon." And no, I don't um have a heart of cards, Wazzy. Thank you. We are at 132. I know it, or yeah, 132. I know it doesn't look like it, but we actually are. I will reset it after the stream, but we are actually at 132. Um, which means you guys unlocked two new things. Would you like to know what you unlocked? I will tell you what Pinecone and Ryura have unlocked for you guys. Bingle. I will tell you. And Onion Circus, give me another bingle. Damn it, Onion Circus. Okay, so we are now at 123, actually. Um, so thank you. 
24, actually. 124. Thank you, Onion Circus, for giving two subs and it only counting one. I don't know why this fucking thing only counts half of it, but whatever. Um, <clears throat> Yashi Lover says, have the last of my bangles. Thank you. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 she says you do too much to me, not for me. <laughs> yeah, I do say that. Because sometimes I have to eat, I, sometimes I have to eat mint chocolate, and sometimes I have to... Pick a god and bingle. Sometimes I have to fucking um, drink pickle soda live on stream, and sometimes I have to eat mint chocolate. So, yes, of course it's, you guys do too much to me. All Demand right. to see Bangle's manager. <laughs> fucking stop bingling. Stop bingling out there. Okay, let me, let me tell you guys. Let me, let me tell you guys what you unlocked. Uh -uh. You have unlocked a new sound Did alert. somebody say bingles? Because I'm a bangle, just so you know. You guys can choose what you would like for a new sound alert. And you... Oh, no! Oh, my God! I'm actually really excited for this one. During the mega stream, you guys have unlocked... You write a fanfic. Read a bingle. We are gonna... We're gonna have a Mad Libs-like fanfic, and you guys are gonna write a fanfic uh, during the mega stream. Um, and the next one to unlock is at 140, and it will be Furby joins. Oh, no. And then 150 is a, is a horror game stream. So let's stay away from that one. Let's stay away from that one. Um, let's let's get back to let's get back to work. <laughs> Gorbrick says, you mean Orion? Who's Onion? Oh, yeah, we mean Orion. Orion is Onion Circus. Look at his name and tell me that doesn't look like the word Onion Circus. Listen, Onion Circus knows what I'm about. Onion Circus has told me, point blank, to my face, looked me in the eyes, and said, it is me, Onion Circus. That's how I know it's okay to just fucking butcher Onion Circus's name. <laughs> Closet says, Wazzy's meltdown at generosity. How dare you, Closet Brony. Also, hello, Chicken Nuggets. Oh my god, Chicken Nuggets is here, everybody. Fuck, we have an emo for you, Chicken Nuggets. Let me find it. Let me fucking find it. Where's my chicken nugget emote? Ha <laughs> ha! Okay. <laughs> Onion Circus says, D don't want to waste more money. Exactly. <laughs> don't throw more money at me. Don't! Pinecone! Pinecone, you wet bitch. You wet bitch. You wet bitch. You wet bitch. You wet... Screw the bingles. I have bangles. You fucking wet bitch. Pinecone! Pinecone, your fucking bank is gonna call you and be like, I'm sorry, are you paying Twitch thoughts? Shut the fuck up. Your fucking bank is gonna call you Pinecone and they're gonna be like, hello, idiot. Are you paying Twitch thoughts? And you're gonna have to look them in the eye and say, yes, there's a fucking idiot on the internet that I just paid a bunch of money to. You can't get that back, Pinecone. Did you know you can contact Twitch all you want? Did you know you could call Twitch right now and they'll tell you to go fuck yourself? Did you know you would do that? You could fucking, you could fucking call Twitch right now and they'll look you in the fucking face and tell you, you fucking idiot. You're not, you're not allowed. You're not fucking allowed. Also, thank you, Trail Mix, for 100 bingle bangles. Fuck me. <laughs> Christ, okay. Renessa says, the fanfic will just end up being a vending machine fanfic. Renessa, I swear to God. <laughs> Gregory says, Wazzy X vending machine. Sarah Lad says, let's see if we can make a better isekai. <laughs> Electra say, I also thought it was Onion Circus. See? Thank you. Just because I don't know how to read doesn't mean you guys also don't know how to fucking read. Onion Circus says, Wazzy spent like two months thinking I was Snake. The only reason I think that you're not Snake Onion is because sometimes you have money. And I have told Froggy this. I have looked Froggy in the face and I was like, Froggy, I don't actually think Onion, Onion Circus is Snake. And he's like, are you sure? How can you be sure? And I'm like, because Onion Circus has thrown bits at me. There's no way Onion Circus can be Snake. <laughs> snake Snake lived in a hotel. <laughs> um, Corbrick says, call it Matt got turned into a vending machine. <laughs> 
Pinecone says, oops, did I hit the new goal? Unfortunately, Pinecone, you did, you fucking idiot. I hope your bank calls you. I hope the bank manager calls you and she's really bitchy and she calls you and she's like, ahem, excuse me, Mr. Pinecone, you have spent far too many, much money on something called twitch.tv.com now we don't want to say that you are paying money to a twitch thought however this is suspicious and we are suspending your transactions that's what I hope happens <laughs> anyway what did you just hit now I gotta add it up manually because this fucking counter is broken Thanks for breaking the fucking counter. Thanks for breaking the fucking counter. I'm so mad at you, Pinecone. Okay, so the actual the actual crew member count is now at 152. You bitch! You bitch, Onion Circus! You just unlocked Horror Game Stream! You fucking bitch, Pinecone! You fucking bitch! Fuck! I'm on swear timer and I'm yelling fuck. I had 25 seconds left in swear timer and I was yelling fuck. I gotta reset swear timer. Oh, you bitch. Oh, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. <sighs> anyway, Lord Alucard is here. Hello, Lord Alucard. Welcome. We're, we're, listen, I'm trying to do Patreon. Listen. Lord Alucard, I'm trying to do work. I'm, I, I, I'm, I'm trying to work. I'm trying to work here. I'm trying to be, I'm trying to be a professional. I'm a professional business guy. Do you not see my little glasses and my little suit and tie today? I'm a professional business guy, Alucard. Alucard, listen, let me level with you. Let me level with you, Dracula backwards. Um, I'm trying to be a business guy. I'm trying to do my damn old job. People have been like, hey, Wazzy, we'll give you money to, um, draw pictures for us and I go okay I will draw those pictures for you so people have given me money to draw pictures for them and I am attempting to do that but unfortunately I am being interrupted by other people paying me money it is a vicious cycle that is hell that is that is it, it is a hellscape that I cannot escape Dracula backwards <laughs> anyway let me catch up Pinecone says, I have received a call. I explained what I was doing to her. She was understanding. God damn it, Pinecone. Get out of here. <laughs> um, Briggs says, Wazzy, would you still love Matt if he was a vending machine? Well, it depends. What's he vending? <laughs> depends what's in the vending machine. I'm going to be 100% honest with you. I'm a little shallow. It depends what's in the vending machine. Is there just Gatorade in the vending machine? Because I don't think I'm down with that. Is there just Mountain Dew in the vending machine? Because I'm not down with that. I have no use for a Mountain Dew vending machine. I don't even like Mountain Dew. <laughs> Sour Lad says, He's a guy where the truck driver is the hero and the victim is the demon lord with the truck as their partner. <gasps> Sour Lad, wait till the next video. I wrote the best isekai ever. Actually, here, let me show you guys Screw it. Bangles. I have bingles. Shush. Wait. Fuck. Shush, says you guys are bingling me so hard and be very nice to me today, unfortunately for me. Um, let me let me show you guys the name of my, my isekai that I wrote that's gonna be in the next video that I told you I sold out really hard in. Here is the here is the name of my new isekai. In another world as an end isekai truck, and now I have to isekai other people to be reborn in other worlds. That's the name of my new isekai. And it's a it's about a dude who gets turned to do an isekai truck. And that's, and that's, and that's my, that's my isekai. Do not steal! Do not steal! Original characters, do not steal! Oh, shit. Um. Anyway, Wazzy, um, Wazzy, would you love Matt even more if he was a Twitch thought? I mean, not really. I think I'd love him the same amount. I don't care what you do with your jobs, crew. I'm not sitting here gonna, like, fucking yell at you guys for whatever your jobs are. I'm not going to be here and be like, ha, you're a Starbucks barista? Get out. Ha, astrophysicist? You fucking idiot. <laughs> Get out of here, you literal idiot. Uh, Lord Alucard says, I literally just came in and I like you. Well, thank you, Alucard. Thank you, Dracula backwards. I hope you and your father have a better time um, with you stealing his name, but just backwards. Um... 
I hope that's going well for you. I hope you're not eating too many people. I hope the blood that you get, Alucard, is sweet and succulent in your mouth, and it is not like the French version of berry, which is fruit savage. <laughs> um, Onions says, so Wazzy, I now have to play... play so Wazzy now has to play a horror game because of Pinecone and I. It's mostly because of all of you, but um, if so, fact so, yes. Greg says, just mint chocolate. And he says, at this point, I'm su subbing to the Patreon. I mean, basically, yeah. And he says, Isekai Trucker. It ain't much, but it's honest work. <laughs> that Isekai already exists. Listen, I'm making it again. Listen. <laughs> I'm allowed to fucking, I'm allowed to fucking make it again. Greg Graves says, it's sad that there's already an Isekai Truck Mega. I hate it. Sarah Lance says, basically, Lightning McQueen killing people as an isekai. Yeah, exactly. Corbrick says, Wazzy, what if someone's job is to destroy the continental United States? Like, just United... I'm in Canada. So, like, I'm okay with that. Like, if you want to enjoy the States, it's all... Like, you want to go fight the States, that's fine by me. I'm, I'm going to be safe here in the cold. Like, 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 go right ahead. <laughs> what am I, what am I going to do? Stop you? Like, go right ahead. <laughs> if that's your job, I mean. Also, thank you, Onion Circus, uh, for gifting two stuff. Also, Onion Circus, stop. Remember, you're supposed to save your money. You stop giving your money to Twitch Thoughts. Also, I got to update the counter. What did I just say? Stop giving your money to Twitch Thoughts, crew. What did I say? I don't even have my boobs out because my swear timer's in the way. <laughs> I don't even have boobs! My PNG tuber doesn't even have boobs. You get nothing from this crew. Also, thank you, Kakashi Lover, for gifting another sub. I now have to add to the total because the thing is broken. Fuck! Thank you, Ryura, for gifting another sub. Damn it! Crew, I'm trying to work. It's business day. It's fucking business day. Lord Alucard says, what are your pronouns, by the way? Oh, I am she, her, but I also respond to they, them. I'm not going to. Um, I'm just not he, him. I can tell you that much. Um... But I do sometimes refer to myself as a little guy. Um, I don't think... I don't know. I'm just kind of... She, her. Bitch. You know, I respond to a lot of things. I'll, I'll respond to anything. Um, I call everybody they, them, unless they specifically tell me otherwise. Unless they look me in my both eyes and say, Wazzy, this is my pronoun. <laughs> Um, Reaver says, uh, do you have any idea of what game you're playing for the horror stream? I don't know yet. Um, somebody said I should play Mortuary Assistant, and I don't know how scary that is. And I want you guys to remember that I am indeed a little baby, um, and will probably cry. Do you guys not remember when I got my ass eaten by that ghost in Fatal Frame? Just expect that for two hours. <laughs> But this time with a save point. Uh, Onion Circus says, Wazzy is flatter than a cutting board. Not my VTuber. My VTuber has boobs. <laughs> Onion Circus. Reaver says, if I stop, how will I take over a stream? How dare you? Corbrick says, Waz non-binary Wazzy just dropped. I don't think so. I don't, like, I don't know. And that's okay to not know. It's okay to not know what your pronouns are or what you are or anything or know your who you want to be or anything like that. It's okay to not know. I'm just I'm just saying as it stands right now, I'm okay with she, her, or they, them. I'm not gonna lose my mind over either. I'm not I'm not coming out as anything. I'm just saying I'm okay with whatever. Just not he him. Or he he! <laughs> <laughs> and she says, Wasi's pronouns are little and piss baby. And Closet Brody says, little guy slash it's my birthday. Trail Mix says, Wasi quote of the day. I don't think, how dare you, tra Trail Mix. Trail Mix, how dare you call me out like this? How dare you? How fucking dare you? On this, my own stream. We're supposed to be the cool guys today. How fucking dare you? Llama says, play Five Nights at Freddy's. This is a joke. L do you want to hear about the first time I ever played Five Nights at Freddy's? It was at Halloween, and it was when Five Nights at Freddy's first kind of came out. And I was too scared to play it. And so my buddy played it, and we got our ass eaten. And it was terrible. 
Lion Tamer says, Wazzy, you should play Mad Father for the horror stream. Uh, oh, I'll write that down, but I don't like the sound of that. I do, Father, Father, please. Okay, I will play Mad Father, but only if I get to use my Clyde Burt voice the entire stream. I know nothing about it, but if I don't get to go in there and pull out Clyde Burt and be like, Father, Father, please do not be angry. Please, Father, do not be cross with me. Father, Father, we are exploring this haunted game. Please don't be cross with me, Father. I refuse to play Mad Father unless I'm in Clyde Burt the entire time. Knock, knock, fucker. How dare you? Ryura says, uh, we should pull for which game you'll play on stream. That's a good idea, Ryura. I will put that up, probably in the Discord, actually. Um, also, Lord Alucard decided they liked it here and they followed. Welcome to the crew, Lord Alucard. Lord Dracula backwards. Um, I don't know why you hit that button, but okay. I, I, okay. Um, that's, um, well, you're stuck now, Dracula backwards. You're, you're stuck with us now. Everybody, everybody be nice to Lord Alucard. <laughs> Listen, listen, everybody, listen, I'm really sorry. Lord Alucard's here. You have to invite him in your home because vampires can't come into your house unless you invite them in. Sorry, I didn't ask. Um, you got to let them into your home um, because they can't come in without asked. Also, no more garlic crew. <laughs> um, Lord says, I always ask because that's what you're supposed to do to people. I know, I'm sorry. Corbrick says, ass is a swear. Yes, but I'm done swear timer. But I'm done swear timer, Corbrick. <laughs> uh, it's just his ass is swear play. I'm going to say I didn't swear. <laughs> I'm going to cut. I'm going to take off swear timer. King says, uh, what is it with you and ass eating now? No, King, this has always been a thing. King, do you not remember? Were you here for Zelda? King, because man, that that ate my ass. If you want to talk about games that ate my ass, um, <laughs> that that man. <laughs> also, apparently, I have another swear timer. So fucking thank you, Icy Jane, you bitch. Gray says, "I kind of want to see you play Ib." Fun fact, Gray, I actually have played Ib. Um, I enjoy Ib. Ib is um, one of those young idiot Wazzy games that I played as a child when I played Yumi Nikki. And I was all hyped up on Yumi Nikki and I was like, I need another game. And Ib came along and I was like, ah, yeah, I'm going to play this. So I would probably play it again. And she says, Alucard, your mother was burned alive and your dad is kind of uh, negligent, not going to lie. Pinecone says, I personally welcome all blood-sucking humanoids into my life. Aw, Pinecone! Is that, so, is that why you, you're you so nice to me, Pinecone? It's because you're like, ooh, I need a little shitty, blood-sucking, piece-of-shit garbage child in my life, and that's why you're so nice to me? <laughs> also, apparently I swore, even though I don't think I did. My swear timer wasn't even on. <laughs> there we go. I have reset it. It's fine. Gosh, she says no more garlic, but what about my garlic bread? Oh, God, I love garlic bread. Yes. God. Ninja Goon says, mmm, garlic bread. I know, I love garlic bread. Listen, I am going to put it on a tier list just to say this is my tier list for four different types of breads. So, A, garlic. Frick, I'm on, I'm on the see-through layer. Hold on. A, garlic. Garlic always wins. Next, cheese. Any kind of cheese bread. Next, regular bread. I don't even care. I don't care. You could be like whole wheat. I don't even care. I don't even care. Bread. And then cornbread. Cornbread is the worst. Cornbread can die for all I care. Only kind of bread I would not eat. <laughs> You can't take away my garlic, garlic privileges, you wench. Lama, that is the first time I've been called wench in a long time. Oh, I forgot about that word. Also, Ninja Goon and Corbrick with both like a fact and a fake fact. So I am going to provide you with facts. And you guys 
um, have to choose which one's fake and which one's real. Mm -mm. The word testify comes from the Roman practice of swearing on your testicles. And Wisconsin, Wisconsin has the most Etsy creators per capita. Those are your two facts. You guys can pick which one of those facts you think is real and which one is fake. <laughs> Ninja Goo, give me a fake fact. Give me a fact, bartender. Uh... And Gorbrick, no, give me a fake fact, bartender. You guys, you guys can pick which one you think is real and which one you think is fake. Ooh, ASJ says Etsy's real and Rome is fake. Electrify says the Testify is real and Etsy is fake. Ooh, who who is everybody siding with? Are you siding with ASJ is right or are you siding with Electrify is right? Are you saying Wazi lied and both are fake? Oh my god, we should do a fake or a real game show. We should have a game show where I pull you guys up and I give you facts and you gotta pick which one's real or fake. Oh, oh, that would be fun. Sorry, I got distracted. I'm supposed to be working, crew. I'm talking about bread. <laughs> Ever heard about the Faith Games by Airdorf? No, but I like the name Airdorf. Lord Alucard says my dad went out for cigarettes 2,000 years ago. <laughs> and he never came back. <laughs> Nocturnal says, so Miss Wazzy, now that you must drink your medical Gatorade, what's your favorite flavor? Or do you have a variety so you don't get tired of a single one? I have a variety of different ones, but I actually really like the green apple one. This is going to sound blasphemous because I'm not going to say I like the blue Gatorade. Um, but I like the green apple one. I was drinking it. I was like, ooh, green Gatorade is so good. And I looked and it was green apple. And I was like, oh, that makes sense. I love green apple. <laughs> Gregory says sourdough, though. Sourdough could go right above bread. Sourdough could go right here. Above regular bread. <laughs> Welcome to my bread tier list, everybody. Um, Pineco says, I just like being a part of the affectionate bullying. How dare you, Pineco? What about pizza? That's a kind of bread. <laughs> 10 out of 10 bread are making. How dare you? Cornbread is amazing. It's gross, King. Anyway, I'll tell you guys the truth. Did you know the Etsy one is fake and the swearing on your testicles is true? Those are your facts. Did you know? You can take that to your party. You could go to the party and when you're sitting there and you're drinking alcohol for the first time and you're looking around and you're like, wow, did you know the word testify comes from the Roman practice of swearing on your testicles? And then everybody will think you're cool. <laughs> Wazzy well, wasn't real all, all along. Miles says, I was gone for 20 minutes and you're still on the same track. Miles! Miles, do you not listen? Mile, miles, miles. I got distracted. I got bingled, and then I had to rate bread. <laughs> so, like, obviously, things happened. <laughs> this is like that time I took that ADHD test. <laughs> um, things listen things happened i got a little distracted i don't bonk me for this i'm things happened things happened D testify all right um <laughs> gorbrick says both are fake no <laughs> Uh, Alucard says, I swear on my balls is just hilarious. <laughs> From now on, I am only ever going to swear on my balls. From now on, everybody. From now on, I'm only ever going to swear on my balls. Also, BMC is here. Hello, BMC. Um, Corbrick says, what about the cinnamon roll? Those are bread. Oh, man, cinnamon roll. Cinnamon roll could go above sourdough. Cinnamon. I don't know how to spell cinnamon. Cin? Cinnamon? I don't know how to spell it. I'll put a question mark. Um, those, those are my, those are my lists. Banana bread. Shit, I forgot about banana bread. Fuck electrify. You so right. Um. Oh god, banana bread. It depends. Does the banana bread have chocolate in it? If it's the kind with chocolate chips, it would be above cheese. I would put banana bread with chocolate chips here. 
banana. I spelled it wrong. Um, but if it doesn't, it goes down here under sour. <laughs> um, pumpernickel is mid at best. I don't like pumpernickel either, but I'll eat that. It would be above regular bread. <laughs> I got distracted. Kakashi Lover says the ADHD test is great. BFC says, where's the barrage of bonks? I don't want them. I'm a little guy. Gray says, oh, can we do the colorblind test then? No, because I'm so not colorblind. You think I'd be an artist if I was colorblind? I don't think colorblind people could be art artists legally. I mean, not that I've ever done an art class, but damn, I'm pretty sure I would be kicked out um, for not being able to see colors. That's like a, like the main point of art sometimes is colors. Anyway, I'm supposed to be working on my Patreon request, everyone. We got the line art done, so at least we did something today. At least I could walk away from today going like, yeah, we did some line art. <laughs> Banana bread is always great. What about cornbread? Cornbread's great. I said that our cornbread sucks. I told you this, Kakashi lover. I almost said great. Plus, <laughs> you can't smell banana. What counts as bread? At some points, dude's like, I swear on my wife's badge, bro. <laughs> uh alucard says is the snake on your head friendly yes it's a it's a crew worm um fuck i should explain um so around these parts everybody um all of you guys when you follow you are considered my crew because i don't just come out here and make content by myself i have a crew behind me i like and appreciate all of you and i can't do the content i do without you guys um except for the animations you guys help dick all with the animations it would fucking would it kill you guys to like maybe pull your weight and maybe do one frame of animation for me it would really fucking help me out bros um anyway <laughs> when when you follow and you're like part of part of the team per se uh, you're part of the crew and, um, and I represent all of you with little worms on a string. Um, I don't know how that happened. That just sort of happened. And so the little worm on my head is, uh, a little crew worm. And if you look at your emojis, you'll see that we've got a whole bunch of different worms. And that just kind of, it's to represent you guys. Cause we are a crew cause we make content together. I may be the lead singer of this band. I may be the the band member that goes into the back and gets all the groupies being like, "Swoo!" I'm like either lead singer or bassist. I am I am I am like the 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 part of the band that gets like the incredible amount of pussy. However, doesn't mean you guys aren't part of it. It's not like ASJ isn't like on the drums. It's not like um Pinecone isn't on keyboard. It's not like Ryura isn't like got a tambourine or some shit. It's not like fucking Lord Alucard, you're not out there with maracas. Because like I re don't fucking bonk a Levania me for getting all the pussy. Um It's we're we're a crew. We make we make this together. I may be the voice of it all. I may be the one in the spotlight being like, Ayo! Welcome to Troy! We are Toxic Crew! We're about to play some songs for you! But I can't play the songs by myself. I need I need you bitches with the tambourines and maracas behind me. So that's why you're part of the crew, and you're represented by the worms, and that's the best way I could explain. And apparently I swore, even though the timer says zero, I'm just saying, you guys could cut me a fucking break you know would be rad to have a break i'll reset it but only because i accidentally forgot to set it before anyway <laughs> let me let me catch back up on chat i'm sorry i went i, I went i went on a bit of a rant what about corn dogs corn dogs are yeah i'm not a fan of corn dogs Corbrick says, Wazzy is canceled for what she said Also carry and also caring about us. I get canceled for caring about you guys? Kira says, gonna be honest, Wazzy, had me draw an animation, it would be bad. I'm just saying, oh, you guys should draw an animation. Everybody draws one frame of animation. It'll turn out great, I promise you. It'll be so bad. Um... Pineco says, Jacob Andrews of Trophy fame is colorblind. Yeah, but he's a better artist than me, Pinecone. Have you ever considered that maybe he's a better artist than me? 
It's just as, whoa, Bob Ross proved that being colorblind is no obstacle to being an artist. Have you ever considered ASJ? <laughs> Can't believe Wazzy's gatekeeping the colorblind. <laughs> Gonna be honest, Wazzy, I'd be drawing animation and would be bad. Wazzy, I've seen you draw and I really want to help. So the only thing I could draw is Riolu. <laughs> hey, Wazzy, what was the candy survey for? That I gave you my address for. It's for candy that's being sent to your house. You get to wait. If you guys got the physical one, you guys have to wait a little bit longer. You may be the spokesman, but you have an entire crew behind your back. Thank you. I call dibs a play triangle. Chat, she's got worms. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, you got to go to the vet. Wait, no, I'm in Canada. I don't have to go to the vet. Listen, you guys are Americans. You guys are the ones that have to go to the vet. Not me. I... I am the kind of guy that doesn't have to go to the vet because I am in Canada. I have health care. Matt's health care pays for me. I don't have to. If When I get sick, I don't have to go. I don't have to go to the vet. I'm able to go to a real actual human doctor. And the real actual human go doctor goes, yep, here's your piss calcium pills. I can go to a real doctor and get my medically and get my medically requested Gatorade. I get to go to a real human physical doctor. That's something you guys don't get to do. As Americans, you guys don't get to go see a real human doctor. You got to go to the vet. I don't got to go to the vet. I can walk into the emergency room, sit there for nine hours, and, and get and, and get a Band-Aid. And then I won't be charged $47 for the Band-Aid. Wazzy, do you play D&D? &D? Yes, Llama, I do play D&D. &D. Actually, that's a lie. I play two D&D-like games that are not D&D. &D. I play Pathfinder, which is pretty much exactly like D&D. &D. And the other game I play is called Alternity, which is like D&D &D in space. And it has a completely different system because instead of rolling 20s, instead of trying to roll 20s, you want to roll 1s. So it gets real confusing. Um, but they're both fun. And I have played several campaigns of both of those. So if you're going to ask me what character I play, I have played several. <laughs> Electrify says, now I'm wondering what instrument I am. I don't know, like a fucking xylophone. You're so, so like Arctic phone. Oh, can we play that next Sunday? Um, no, this Sunday is um, Leon Sonic Kennedy um, crowd control is this Sunday. Nocturnal says, only November 4th. Um, yeah, we're almost to the end of the first goal. I know. I'm so sad. Chase says, bold of you to assume we can afford the vet. We just die. Oh, you're right. I'm so I'm so sorry, Icy Jade. You're right. If you're American and you're and you, and you broke your leg, you might as well just lay down. Just lay down. It's okay. No, he would goes to the vet. We go to the doctor. No, no, no. If you're American, no. Does Canada healthcare extend to dogs? No, it doesn't. Actually, that's part of why we're doing Crew Vember, is because I have extensive medical bills for the cats. I have to pay more for my cat. Okay. I took Tail to the vet. As you guys remember, Tail scared herself, hurt her leg. I had to take her dumb ass to the vet. Cute ass cat. I love her to death, but goddamn, I wish she didn't fucking like drop kick the side of a wall or something and hurt her foot and she was limping around and I got scared that she broke her fucking foot and I had to take her to the vet and they had to check her all out and that cost me like fucking 200 fucking bucks and I was like god damn now you can get pet insurance but I don't have pet insurance because I'm like why am I gonna pay pet insurance for a cat that doesn't even go outside but unfortunately she's fucking stupid uh and hurt herself indoors anyway um so <laughs> it's not that bad it could have been worse. And also they want to do a blood test on her because she's getting older. So that's unfortunate. Uh, <laughs> dying is financially irresponsible. Irrespons it's true. Sarah Liz, is that video of a nurse doing a TikTok while the man is suffering is pre-American health care? Yeah, it is. Also, Sarah Liz gave me a stretch. Thank you. And apparently I swore, though. I don't think I did. Guys, come on. Come on. Stop narking. What's rule five? Class, what's rule five? That's right. No narking. Nocturnal says, wait, uh, since, um, actually, since you go to the doctor to get the Gatorade, does that mean they paid for it for you? Oh, no, they just told me to drink Gatorade. 
they didn't they didn't tell me they they don't prescribe it's not actually prescribed to me it's not like it's it's a it was just when i got when i got these stupid pills i was on she's like yeah this is also gonna drop your electrolytes like super bad so um you're gonna want gatorade and i was like what and she's like yeah just any sports drink really yeah you, you're gonna be oh, sleepy you can't unbingle that bang don't bingle me um they're like you gotta you're gonna you're gonna have no electrolytes you're gonna be sleepy tired you're gonna you're gonna want as much gatorade as you can get your hands on so yeah that's why i have it um <laughs> Who goes to the doctor for a Band-Aid? I know it's Canada, but still. <sighs> Kakashi Lover says, I don't think you realize how expensive the vet is here in America. Gear says, I assumed you had something planned this Sunday. That's why I said next Sunday. Oh, okay. Rira says, Leon, saw the Kennedy hype. I can be nice to you this time instead of what I did last time. That would be nice. That would be super nice. Um... Grace says, just put your cats on top of each other in a trench coat and get them treated as a human. <gasps> You're right, Grey Grace. That's so much smarter. ASJ says, disappearing now. Good luck getting a single frame of work done, was he? ASJ, I'm trying. Maybe if you were bingling me so hard. Maybe. Maybe if you were freaking. I'm on swear time. Like freaking bingling me. I would get job work done. Sour Lad says, will you ever try the stream avatar extension? Mm, doubtful. I don't know if my laptop can handle it, if I'm being 100% honest with you, Sour. Uh, Nocturnal Blade says, Leon Sonic Kennedy still needs to rescue Ashley Robotnik, Graham. Um, Dracula Backwards says, uh, we went from isekais to bread to worms to worms to you sending us to the vet to you insulting the colorblind all within five minutes all. Alucard, you're new here. Um, you know, there's a little, there's a little unfollow button. You're going to have to understand. Um, we don't have a, we don't have a conductor. We don't, we're not sitting, we don't, <sighs> basically, we just talk here. Basically, basically how streams usually go. I come out and sometimes I draw art requests. Sometimes I just, I, I, I work on stuff. Sometimes I play a little game. I just, I, I, sometimes I just come out here and I do a little, a little do, do, do kind of jig for you guys. Um, and, um, sometimes we get work done. Sometimes we don't. And, um, a lot of the time, um, we just bounce everywhere. We have, we have nine different conversations going at any point in time. It's because it's a conversation and I'm talking to all of you at once. None of us can stay on topic. All of us are ADHD here, I'm starting to think. It's not just me. It can't just be me. I'm not the only guy. I can't be the only guy here who's, who's, who's all f fucked up and hyped on everything. I can't be the only dude. So, um, we gotta, we gotta go everywhere. And we yell about things. And sometimes I go off on a tangent for like 45 minutes. And that's the stream. Who fucking knows what we'll talk about? We have no idea what we're talking about 80% of the time. Anyway. Gear says, shout out to when I crashed Pokemon Silver. I am Wazzy Supervillain. Yeah, you did. You fucking broke Silver. You're never going to get that back. Uh, Lion Tamer says, Wazzy is the most ADHD brain of them all. How dare you, Lion Tamer? In my own stream. Apparently, I swore. But apparently, you guys are narcs. Have you ever considered not narking? Weenies. Sour Lion says, definitely 20 to 30 little guys killing each other on screen would kill your laptop. <sighs> Dr. Dull says, that's, what, uh, that's the chaos you signed up for. Electrify says, the only thing that's consistent is these streams is Wazzy not doing any work. Hey, Electrify, hey, listen, am I not finally coloring the piece I said I would color? Am I not finally now, just now, at hour 25 into the stream, doing the work I said I would do? Huh? It, does that not entertain you? Does that not appease you? Me finally doing the work I'm doing? How dare you? It's my own stream. 
Uh, the closet says, uh, surely uh, can't just be the streamer. Y yeah, no, it's not me. Listen, we're having a conversation here. Listen, I wouldn't need to switch topics so much if you guys weren't like, hey, look, something to distract you. What? Like, you guys, okay. Let me sip my water and collect my thoughts. Imagine. Imagine you are surrounding a baby gate. Okay? Just imag imagine you're around a little baby gate or a baby playpen, right? And there's a little guy in the I'll draw it for you guys. I'll, I'll give you guys visual representation of what's happening right now. Here's a little, here's a little baby playpen thing. I don't know what babies go in. I don't know anything about babies. Okay. Um, here's a little baby playpen. Okay. Here's a little, little happy, little happy, we'll make a purple, little happy baby pay, playpen. Let's say there's a little happy baby playpen. Let's say there's a little guy inside the playpen. The little guy just happens to be Wazzy. All right. It's just a little guy inside the little playpen. And it's me. And the playpen is twitch.tv.com. Okay? And I'm just a little guy. And I'm just like minding my own business. And I'm sitting in my little playpen. And I'm, 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 I'm having a good little time. I can't do the splits. But I'm drawing me doing the splits. Imagine I can, First, I need you guys to imagine I can do the splits. Okay. Keep imagining that. So I'm just a little guy inside my little baby playpen, and I got like some paper and a pen, and I'm and I'm I'm drawing. I'm I'm just having a little a little time. And this and this playpen is twitch.tv.com. Okay, okay. Imagine that. Now, imagine you guys crew. You guys are outside this playpen. You're looking in the playpen. You see you see a little guy in the playpen. You guys are all standing outside the playpen like, wow, look at this little idiot baby go. Right? You're all like, wow, look at this little guy. That little guy sure can art. Um, and you guys are all like standing outside. You're like, you're, you're looking in. You're like, wow, that's, that's amazing, right? Now, imagine all of you have keys in your hand all of you have a shiny key ring maybe you've got maybe you've got some kind of like cool little anime pendant on there like one of them cell phone charms that you used to have like maybe you've got maybe you've got your house key and also you got your car key and you drive a lexus or something i don't know is that a that's a car breed right lexus is a car breed yeah that sounds right um Maybe you've got one of them smart homes, so you've just got like one of those circle things. Maybe, maybe you've got a cool keychain from that time that you went to the Grand Canyon or something, right? Now imagine all of you start jingling those keys at the same time to the little guy that's in the playpen. And the little guy now has to be distracted by nine keychains going off at the same time. And they gotta they gotta bounce around inside the playpen and give attention to all these different key janglings at the same time. That's what's happening here. That's what's that's what that's that's the thing that's happening here. So just imagine if you're like Man, we jumped bingle, from talk. Bingle. Don't fucking bingle bangle me. We're jumping from topic to topic. Well, I'm going to tell you something. It's because you're all jangling your keys. And I'm a little guy inside the little baby playpen. And I got to pay attention to all them jangling keys. <laughs> uh, and that's the best way I can explain it. <laughs> Harry Graves says, "Was he's getting distracted by cat chat jangling keys in front of him?" Exactly, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Miles says, "Was he just do a vlog? You can't make excuses for not doing work when you uh, don't have work, but you still screw that up somehow." Miles, I can't do a vlog. I'm not a vlogger, Miles. I am a I'm an animator. I'm an animator. I can't. I don't show my face. I don't have a face to perceive. I am an innocent guy. I don't have a face to perceive. We are, I'm not a vlogger. I don't just sit and sit in front of a camera and be like, hey guys, I'm going to tell you about the time I got a back alley deal from a magician. I can't convey 
the interesting way I almost got stabbed by a magician through my words and body language alone. You need a you need a you need a little you need a little funny picture to 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 illustrate the point. I'm a better storyteller when I've got a little picture. Do you not see what I did here? Do you not see what I did here? Do you not do you not see all of this? Do you not see how I'm a better storyteller when I got little things to entertain you? Oh no, I'm getting fucking raided. Oh no. Fuck, I'm getting raided. This is an embarrassing time for me. When I just committed to being a baby. Anyway, everybody shut up and pretend we're cool. Everybody, everybody I need you to do is solid and pretend I'm a cool rad uh, pro streamer and not a little guy uh, knock, knock. paying attention to jingling keys. We gotta welcome a whole bunch of crew members. Shut the fuck up. Hello, it's Ven Games. We're totally normal dudes here. How are you, uh, Ven Games? Everybody shout them out. They were enjoying just chatting. They were just chatting. Okay, Ven, I'm going to have to go and check that out. How how are you, Ven? Get some water in your body. You've probably just been streaming for an uncomfortably long time, so I hope you are now relaxing and getting liquid in your body. Um, welcome! Welcome, Ven, and also friends of Ven. I will welcome everybody to the crew in a second. Um, but yeah, w welcome! I hope you had fun just chatting. I'm supposed to be working, but I'm gonna show you guys I'm totally not working. I've been totally... Fuck it. Please stop calling me out for swearing. Pretend, crew, r remember when I said pretend to be cool? <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Um, hello, friends of Ven. I hope Ven entertained you, um, with, 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 with the sweet, sexy sounds of their voice. Um, and I hope th they blew your minds with their way more better operation than I have here. <laughs> Long resetting swear timer. Um, there we go. Anyway, also, welcome to the crew now. Um, it's Ven Games and also Beth A97. Oh no, Beth 97. 97. Beth, you were born when Pokemon came out? You were a literal toddler. Oh, Beth, you literal toddler. Welcome to the baby. Welcome welcome to the baby cage. Um, crew is bangling, is, is jingling keys at me, and I'm getting horribly distracted, even though I'm supposed to be working on Patreon requests. I haven't even got to my Patreon request because I'm too busy yelling about things. Anyway... Welcome. Enjoy your time. I hope Ben entertains you. I'll have to go check out Ben later. I cannot do it at this point in time, but once I'm live. <laughs> um, Nick goes, you swore? <laughs> Nick, don't narc on me! <laughs> um, Closet Brody says, Wazzy's an incredible streamer. I am not forced to say this. That's right, Closet Brody. <laughs> Checks in the mail, buddy. <laughs> uh... Beth says I'm 25. Listen, Beth, I know, but I was I was already alive when 1997 happened. Listen, listen, Beth, I was alive when 1997 happened. I was a human. I was a human. I had I had thoughts. They weren't good thoughts. I was still a child, but I had thoughts. I had cognitive thoughts when when 1997. Heckle Jack says not a toddler, newborn. You incorrect swine. Oh, jeez. No, Hecklejack, that would be toddler to me. <laughs> um, Sourlad says, join us for fun and games on Crevember, a month-long sabbath. Oh, uh, Sourlad, are you fucking, are you pro promoting me? Sourlad, are you doing my fucking job for me? I mean, I know you're the best mod, but like, how dare, how dare you introduce me for me? <laughs> how, how fucking dare you? <laughs> Also, again, I want to remind everybody that Twitch is again giving me the notification to how to do my own job. Um, not only Sour Lad, but both Sour Lad and Twitch are like, hey, idiot, you, did you remind people to to fucking follow you? Also, Lord Alucard says, it's nice to meet you, Wazzy. Hi, Lord Alucard. You've been here for a bit, huh, Lord Alucard. I don't know why you're saying nice to meet me now. You've already insulted me like three times, I think. <laughs> Lion Timber says, Wazzy is a kind of funny streamer. How dare you? Uh, I was definitely not paid to say this. <laughs> exactly. Yes. Yes. Good. Evil. 
Riru says, yo, everyone, I have to get back on Wazi's good side after getting her that arrow candy bar, so stop narking. Yes, thank you. God, mint chocolate is the worst thing anybody's ever invented. I don't know why they had to take chocolate and fuck it all up. I don't know why they did that. <laughs> uh, Miles says, Wazzy's the real toddler um, with the floor sit story. Miles, how dare you? All right, goodbye, Beth. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate you. Um, Sarah Lance says, most calm Wazzy stream. Yeah, we're totally calm all the time. And no dinkies here. Oh my God, did I not draw my dinky of the day? I didn't because I was doing work and, and talking about bread. I'll do it here on the twitch.tv.com. I'll here, I'll give I'll give one of you a dinky. There you go. Nice dinky. Good job. Good job on the dinky. A dinky pointed towards your waifu um keychain. There. It's Miku. <laughs> there. <laughs> Lion Tamer says, you just to make that decision. Now perish. Fight, 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 fight. Man, I wish we were playing um, Cult of the Lamb right now because I would definitely start some old people fight club. Miles says, how dare I? Well, I want you to know that. Um, <laughs> well, do you want that or do you want vending machine smut? <sighs> Miles. Can I vote neither? Can I say I want neither of those things? Can I look you in the face and say, I don't want the vending machine smut to be my legacy. Can I, can I be, can I be genuine and real with you? One day, I hope to walk into a place and have somebody go, oh my God, it's Wazzy from twitch.tv uh, com. That's my dream to get uncomfortably recognized in real life. Like anybody's dream. And I don't want them... I don't want the next words after... Is it that Wazzy from twitch.tv.com? I don't want the next words out of, be, out of their mouth to be... The one who reads... Uh, reborn as a vending machine? Um, um, and, and now I wander the dungeon. I had to re-look it up. It's sitting on my desk still. I don't want the first words out of their mouth for that. <laughs> Matt says, no, you can't. Either child or vending machine lady. Oh, God, I don't want either. Lord Alucard says, I was waiting for you to finish that, that whatever that thought ecosystem. Wait, what? I was waiting for you to finish whatever thought ecosystem this lol. Am I an idiot? Can I not read? Am I having a thought ecosystem? I think Lord Alucard is all. You've been here 20 minutes, fucking Dracula backwards, and you're already throwing fucking shade at me? You've been here 20 minutes! How, how fucking, how fucking long does a crew member have to be a crew member before they can start talking shit about me? I think this is fucking, how dare you? How, how dare you? Okay, no, that's not true. Because Potato came in and, like, Potato joined once and the first thing Potato ever said to me was, you're kind of funny. So I guess it doesn't really take that long. But so, damn, damn, you haven't put your fucking time in yet. You fucking, how dare you? I hate, I hate that crew. I, I hate that you guys are able to like join a stream and within five minutes, you've got me pegged out as a fucking idiot. And you're like, oh yeah, we know, we know everything you're about, Wazzy. You're a fucking moron. And I fucking, man, I wish I wasn't such a moron. I wish I could convince people I wasn't a moron for like, at least longer than 20 minutes. I need to I need to learn to not be a moron for 20 minutes. <laughs> uh let's just do a parody of the daily dose of internet in intro with the hey internet, here's your daily dose of dinky as a redeem. Uh Gregory says, Oh my god, it's a vending machine streamer. How dare you? I, I hope one day I raid somebody and they go, Oh, Toxicure, you read the vending machine manga. How is it? Yeah, that's what I want. That's what I fucking want. 
Anyway, <laughs> Closet Brony says, Quirk questions of any machine or the Final Fantasy person. You take your pick. Final Fantasy! Final Fantasy, please! Please! Please, Closet Brony, if I'm allowed to pick Final Fantasy, please! Fucking please! Or the poison of Ipso Faxo. Fuck. I. God, I don't know. I don't know. Can I be can I be known as the super cool rad bad boy of the internet? Can my legacy be the cool rad internet bad boy? <laughs> Gregor says one second, that's all it takes. Alucard says I tease because I care. <laughs> Pico says, Yeah, I was here a year before I said anything. Yeah, that's right. Pineco was here a year. I actually, um, uh, Pineco, I don't wanna <laughs> This is gonna make me sound paranoid. This is going to make me sound awful and paranoid, and apparently I swore I'll give you guys this one, but I'm totally going to ace the next 10 minutes. Um, not, not to look paranoid and suspicious of everything forever. Um, but, Pinecone, when you came in here and, like, the first thing you ever did was drop a bunch of subs, and I... It's not that somebody hasn't come in, dropped subs, and then never talked to me again. That's happened before. Somebody just came in and was like, hey, read a act of kindness, and dropped, like, five subs and then left. And I was like, oh, that's dope. I'll pay that forward. Um, but you came in, you dropped a ton of subs, and then was, and then you, you had your first chat. And I was like, you don't know me. How, how do you even know you're going to like this content? How do you know you didn't just pay a whole bunch of money to, to, to like, like somebody who was like, yeah, I, like a like a transphobe or something. Like, how do you know you didn't just do that? And then you were like, I've been here a year. And I was like, well, that's sus. This is your first time chat and you're saying you've been here a year? That's suspicious. Um, So I Googled it. Uh, there's actually a website where you can type in a username of somebody and then type in a username of another person and see if that if that person is following that person and if so how long so i did that and you had indeed been following for a year and i was like that's suspicious <laughs> so not 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 to look like a crazy person or anything but i did indeed fact checked um, anyway, Electrify is giving me, um, uh, hydrate, and I really wish it wouldn't because I really have to pee, but I have 15 minutes left in this stream, and I can hold my pee for 15 minutes. I could do it. Anyway. Slice Coffee says, how long have you been drawing this? Slice Coffee, please. Please, 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 Slice Coffee, please. Uh, an hour and f 44 minutes. <laughs> If you must know, if you must know, slice coffee, my coffee dear, uh, at hour 44. <sighs> and look at all the work I got done. I did boxes, no, not even good boxes, and also some coloring. <laughs> oh, man. Alucard says, in real life, I'm quiet, um, but I'm not BSing. Uh, something's wrong. Okay, that's fair, I guess. <laughs> some people, some people only type in chat and that's okay. And some people just hang out in chat, I guess, which I think is weird. Because I read every chat, I try to read every chat member. Or like every chat message. So I kind of think it's weird when people just come in and lurk. Like, I don't like the sound of my voice. So like, I can't imagine you're sitting there like at your family dinner, like just listening to the sound of my voice being like, ah, yes, time to get my daily dose of Wazzy content in. Man, man, she's got such a beautiful voice. What, how fucking spectacular. I'm just going to look and have this in the background while I do far more important things. I can't imagine that. I wouldn't want to fucking listen to me while I'm doing other shit. Unfortunately, I do, and I have to. um, Because I'm doing... Like, I'm basically, I'm trying to get clips for things, um, for animations while I'm actually working. <laughs> Phoenix Wolves says, how dare you call me up? Also, apparently I swore. Um, <laughs> was he stalking the viewers? Fico says, yeah, I make myself look sus. 
Uh, I get it. It's fair. It's fair. Um, one of the white mage is making progress. I see. White mage, how dare you? Mage, how dare you? Look, do you not see me being a good little worky guy? I'm on swear timer. You weenie. You corn dog bread weenie. You weenie and a corn dog bread. <laughs> um. <laughs> Wazzy's 15 minute no piss challenge. Let's go. It's no pee November, guys. <laughs> I'm going to try really hard for the next 15 minutes that I have to pee. It's really hard. Um, also, Be Beebly gave me stretch. Thank you, Beebly. <laughs> Wait, Mage says, I tend mostly lurk on any given stream while I play games. Yeah, I also kind of do that. I also kind of have background noise. But that's of better streamers than me. That's of, like, my friends or something, or, like, people that are more talented than me. Like, those are the kind of ones I listen to. Not my voice. I wouldn't listen to my voice on a stream. Unless I'm legally obliged to. <laughs> Um, Closet Birdie says, you're my favorite streamer because you read every chat. Uh, gives us a community, but sometimes I'm quiet because I'm playing a game. Like, I don't care if you guys chat or not. I just think it's weird to... Like, just lurk at me, I guess. I don't know. Um, that's... I don't know. I just find it weird. I don't... I'm, that's just me. Not that I don't do it. I just don't think I'm the caliber of streamer that you should do that for. I guess is the way I'm trying to put it. Um... Miles says, well, do you want the eye traffic or not? I mean, I do, but also, I don't know. I just don't think I'm that caliber of streamer. I don't think I'm freaking worthy of, like, you know, you being like, ah, I'm just going to listen to Wazzy stream. Go, ah, Wazzy streaming. Time to chill out and listen to that. Like, I don't, in my opinion, in my humble opinion, Toxic here sucks. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sarah Les says, was he yelling about a dinky and rants? It's just a little treat. <laughs> My God says, um, I legit spent uh, that year just laying in my bed listening to your stream away from a keyboard. Pinko, were you just like in bed for a year? Were you in a hospital bed for a year? Just like, and you couldn't reach the phone? <laughs> you were stuck on twitch.tv.com slash deep dog secure? Alucard says, I like you. That's why I crack jokes. It's okay, Alucard. Don't worry. I'm not making fun of you. Alucard, I'm not making fun of you. We all make fun of each other here. That's that's the point of streams. <laughs> What's the point of streams if we can't make fun of each other? Um, <laughs> Muddle White says, you are making progress. I'm trying. God, I have four Patreon requests that I have, and I've barely done one. Gray says, I have this on while I do work stuff. And then it brings me peace. Paradox says, am I able to make a request on Patreon while the request stream is going on and get it drawn? Uh, unfortunately, no. Just because, A, I'm near the end of this stream. Um, but you, if Patreons can specifically request that their request gets worked on during stream. I have allowed that where some people are like, never do my art requests on stream. And other people are like, hey, you should do my request on stream. I think it would be dope. Um, so it's always, it's always give or take. I am, I am willing to arrange it. I just, I, at this point in time, I cannot because I'm near the end of stream and I barely done this one. I was hoping to get done two art requests for Patreon and I've got done 0.5. <laughs> Uh, Mamazon Prime uh, mascot ready to not give out the winner gift card. Thanks, Sour Lad. Kakashi says, is it weird that I fall asleep to, uh, to you talking before? That is weird. I've got an annoying ass voice. <laughs> and I yell frequently. Like, I don't know how you can fall asleep to me talking because, like, sometimes I'll just be like a calm little, hey, guys, welcome to stream. And then the next thing you know, I'm like screaming paradox says also um honestly you are entertaining as af and the reason why i wouldn't listen to your own voice is because no one wants to listen to their own voice oh yeah that's nice 
Sarah Lance says, don't deny it. Was he your funny little guy? Was he super ju judgmental towards lurkers? <laughs> um, it also comes from animating. Okay, cause, so I animate. I have to listen to my own voice repeatedly. For like, you guys don't understand. I work like eight hours a day on animation. Around. Around eight hours a day. Sometimes it's less, sometimes it's more. It depends on the animation I got. Um, but I got to listen to my own voice every day for eight hours. And it's not even like just constant talking. It's little like drips and drabs. Like here, I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys what I have to listen to every day. And you'll understand why I think my voice is annoying. I'm just going to open up the last one I did. Um, so this is what I got to listen to. So it's broken up like that. That's what I got to listen to all day while I'm animating things. <laughs> um, anyway. Um, anyway, let me catch you back up on chat. Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay. Um, Paradox says, you are that caliber streamer. First time I came here, I was depressed and you made me laugh so hard despite all the odds. Oh my God, I didn't think you were going to say despite all the odds. I thought you were going to say until I peed myself. And I was like, what? <laughs> Phoenix Wolf says, you're so animated when you talk. Phoenix Wolf, we had to remove from the VTuber, we had to remove hand gestures except for wave because I would set them off because I hand talk so badly. Like in real life, if we get to the thing where I have to do a real life cam stream, you will see how much I talk with my hands, especially if I'm not drawing. <laughs> Beebly. <laughs> Beebly, I love your name. Uh, Beebly just says, if I had some fan art, is there any platform in particular you like getting those shared to you? I love fan art. Fan art is the greatest thing. Um, Mostly it's in the Discord or Twitter. If you're not in the Discord, throw it on Twitter because I love Twitter because then I could share it to everybody else. You can also give it to Tumblr, but like Tumblr's not really good at sharing everything and I don't really promote that I have a Tumblr and I'm still on that hell site, but I like that hell site. Um, it's just, it's what a, but yes, I love fan art. Even if you're like, ah, oh, this fan art sucks. I love it. I love it. I love fan art because fan art's so great because the reason why fan art is so great is because somebody took their time to draw you something. And I think that's so neat that somebody was like, I, 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 I sat down and I worked real hard on a thing for you. And I think that's neat. Anyway. Um, um, Alucard said, weenie and a corn dog bread is a phrase for Wasi merch. I will skin you like a chicken nugget. It should be another one. I should start using that more often. I've only said that twice in my life, um, but I'm starting to really like, I will skin you like a chicken nugget. Um, Sarah Lance says, you got 100 plus subs in one stream. Shut up, Wazzy. You're the best streamer. Uh, no. Um, that just means that um, Pinecone makes bad financial choices. <laughs> Miles says, Wazzy, I'm not worthy. I'm not worthy. You could guess this reference if you want. It's, um, that would be Wayne's World. <laughs> Paradox Cats says, I just got here. I know, I know. But I, listen. Dinner is being made and I got to go sit on the floor. <laughs> Michael says, I'm reasonably healthy. 2000 and, um, and 2021 was just a tiring year. Oh man, I get that. I feel that. Uh, Kat says, but anyways, I'll just say it now and then. I want to see what you think of it then. Next stream, I'm going to put a request of Snom uh, riding a nuclear bomb. <laughs> and an arrow pointed at them saying he's swearing anti-nuclear bomb spray. He's fine. I love Snom. I love Snom because he's got the face of a butt. <laughs> Wazzy, well, the gremlin over here, not knowing that there's a gremlin fetish. Miles, don't tell me that. Miles, don't tell me that. I don't want to stop coming here with dead birds of facts. I don't like them. <sighs> Sorry, let's say, wow, that took a while. I know I'm working on catching up. Hold on. Phoenix says, I found memories of Tumblr, but I don't uh, use that hell site anymore. I still use that hell site because at least it's in chronological order and never has tried to um, algorithm me. And I love it. <laughs> 
Why don't white says, I don't know, but I ended up getting uh, insulted any time in chat here, but in a good way. <laughs> My, white mage, I've never! Uh, how dare you? I, A, I beat fucking swear timer, so fuck yeah. Um, I have never insulted anyone ever in my life. I am the nicest. I am the third nicest person you know. How dare you? Um, <laughs> Light Tamer says, I keep forgetting to submit my uh, Grizzly and Zat fan art. Grizzly, Gur plus Wazi, and Zat, Zim plus Matt. You think I wouldn't be the sm I would be the smart one in that operation. You don't know this, uh, Lion Tamer, but I'm actually incredibly intelligent. Um, Nocturnal says in 2020 I was crying a lot from my father's recent passing and, and Miss Wazi's streams helped me cheer me up with her chaos and loads of laugh. Oh, huh? well, that's nice. Was I streaming in 2000? Yeah, I was. I was a full-timer by then. Um, Phoenix Wolf says, lies. I can still smell the BS from here in America. How can, how can you? Your healthcare system doesn't fix your nose, Phoenix Wolf. Oh, Lord Alucard said, when you said the chicken nugget thing, I straight up wheezed. No, Alucard, it's real. Um, that's not a joke or anything that crew is making up to make fun of you or anything. Um, chicken nuggets are better when you peel the skin off the chicken nugget first and then you eat the chicken. Um, uh, Miles says, I have never insulted anyone ever in my life, fibbing wazzy. How dare you? We're near the end of stream and I didn't even finish my request. I hope you guys are happy with yourselves. I hope you're happy. I hope you go home today and you'll go, wow, we did such a good job making sure wazzy didn't do her job. Man, crew... I have so many Patreon requests and I have done none of them. I've done absolutely none of them. I hope you're happy with yourselves. I hope when you go to bed tonight, you have sweet little dreams. You close your little eyes and you have sweet little dreams. And you go, hi, ah, I'm dreaming of me being in a in a field of raspberries. Uh, it's my favorite dream. I get to live in a in a... A field of raspberries. It's so wonderful and perfect. I love my field of raspberries dreams. And then one of the raspberries grows teeth and starts trying to eat you back. And you go, oh, no, this is a nightmare. The raspberries are trying to eat me. And then they skin you like a chicken nugget. Wazzy, well, what is 57 times 69? Uh, uh, 142. Miles says less than one image on a stream. So inefficient. Miles, I am a working guy. I'm a working, I'm a working individual. I am, I am. We're going to put on the GeoCities fire. You guys want the GeoCities fire? I'll put the GeoCities fire on. Enjoy this low res GeoCities fire. That's what you get. We're near the end of the stream, so it won't have to pause in, in the middle and re-loop. <laughs> Paradox says, I'm allergic to raspberries, so that would be worse. Yeah, I hope you, you get skinned by raspberries and then you find out you're allergic to raspberries and you're like, this is worse. And then all your non-skin breaks out in hives. <laughs> Phoenix Wilson, um says, oh no, Wazzy has to spend more time with us doing art because we distracted her. La gasp. No, I'm going to end the stream soon. I just got to work on this off stream. Um, but that probably means next Friday is probably going to be another Patreon work stream because I've got so many to do. Um, I forgot. I actually have five I need to do. I forgot one. Damn. Sourlet says, skin of the chicken nugget. New horror game. <laughs> Jiggles keys to distract Wazzy's, Wazzy's rage. My good says, this chat has the highest densities of allergies I've ever seen. Yeah, everybody here has an allergy. It's great. I like it. I like it because then I can find your weakness. <laughs> uh, is this the boss mo monster's arch uh, nemesis? Jane is the one person who's not allergic to things. Oh, and Ryura. Oh, okay. So you three don't have. Okay, you could, you three got to protect the rest of us. Pinecone is like allergic to peanuts, which is weird because like you can put peanut butter on a on a pine cone and put it outside for birds. Well, he's allergic to working. I am allergic. Okay. 
I don't know if Alucard's still here, but I feel like Alucard needs to um, know the list of Wazzy's fears and allergies so that if, if an emergency happens, everybody needs to know my fears and allergies. Okay, here's a comprehensive list. Things Wazzy is afraid of and also her allergies. Okay, so things I am afraid of. Vacuums. Vacuums, number one. Number one fear, vacuums. Uh, number two, um, uh, birds. Number three, these are technically in order. They're just in order of what I'm, what I'm thinking about. Um, Roombas, which are kind of vacuums, but also robots. So it's kind of, um, four, ball jointed dolls. Ball jointed dolls. These are just fears. These aren't allergies. Allergies are on this side. Allergies. Penicillin. I can't have penicillin. Two, bee stings. Three, strawberries. But the strawberries is very mild. I can eat about 50 strawberries before this strawberry thing takes effect. So, just so you know. <laughs> um, Alucard says, I'm allergic to bees. Good, like me. Pico says, I'm, um, I am on the bringing up, I am bringing the average up. Sarlette says, I'm allergic to your BS, Wazzy. Kat says, Wazzy's trying to pull a Batman and make a contingency plan to kill the viewers. <laughs> it's true, Kat. It's true. Corbrick says, there is no uh, herd immunity to an allergy. Isn't Wazzy scared of everything? Oh, ghosts. Um, <laughs> um, fuck. Vor is here and says, I'm not allergic to anything and I will survive you all. Corbrick says, Wazzy, are you a strange cat? Um, Wazzy's allergic to dilly bars and mint. No, I just don't like mint. That's on the side of things I don't like. Cat says, I'm also allergic to butter, but I'm not eating it. It's just touching my face. Oh. Starlight says, you have a fear of bunnies. Oh, that's also true. Six bunnies. Actually, not bunnies. Jackrabbits. So rabbits more than bunnies. If you got just a cute little bunny, I'm like, oh, that's cute. But if you got a jackrabbit, I did a whole animation about why I don't like rabbits. I did a whole animation on why I don't like rabbits and why I don't like birds. I didn't actually do the one on birds. I just mentioned it in a different animation. Um, but Roombas are kind of vacuums, but they're also robots. And I also don't really like robots that much. Um, so these two kind of get combined. Um, and also ball jointed dolls are just terrifying. And also Zatch Bell sucks. I just want to point that out because he's kind of like a puppet. I'm not like the biggest fan of puppet. It depends on the kind of puppet it is. Like a sock puppet, I'm not afraid of that. But like, if you've got one of those like dummy puppets with the mouth, like the like the um, goosebumps, Night of the Living Dummy kind of dummy, that spooks me. Don't like it. Don't like it. Not a fan. Not a fan. Corbrick says, "I never saw the one on ghosts. It's one of the or the one on birds. The one on birds is one of the toxic take twos. I think it's a short little video. I can't remember which video it is, but I promise you, there's an animation of it." Um, anyway, I should probably end this stream. I'm going to finish reading chat and then we should go read somebody. Um, Kat says, hey, Wazzy, um, you go, you go by a girl a lot, but you also call yourself a guy sometimes. Is that just a neat little thing you say or are you gender fluid? I don't think I'm gender fluid. Um, I don't actually know. I don't think I am. I pretty much identify as girl, but I call myself a little guy because, like, to me, guy is pretty gender neutral sometimes. Like, when you're like, hey, guys, what's up? Um, so me calling guys is pretty uh, gender neutral, in my opinion. Um, it's not like I won't go by they, them. Um, I just don't... I don't know. I don't know. Um, but I do call myself just a little guy sometimes, and it's it's okay. Um, and I think it's okay that I don't know. Um, so that's just how it is. Um, but I do have boobs, if you must know. <laughs> if you must, if you must know, I am, I am very femme-bodied. Um, I'm just ugly. <laughs> Miles says, anyone allergic to chlorexidine? Because apparently blood drives use that. I don't know what the fuck that is, Miles. 
White Mage says, you were just traumatized by Goosebumps as a kid? I loved Goosebumps as a kid. I was just, I enjoyed being fucking scared, uh, is what that is. Uh, also, Alucard says, I refuse uh, dolls ever since Chucky. That's fair. Bingle, bingle. Uh, Kat says, um, I just gave Wazzy a mini identity crisis. It's not really an identity crisis. I just, I don't know. I, I don't, I don't know, but it's just, I'm not going to be upset no matter what happens. Anyway, uh, Reaver gifted a sub. Uh, thank you for one more sub. I got to put that on the list. Now our thing is real messed up. Um, <laughs> Wazzy is booba confirmed. There's one last sub before the end of the stream. Thank you. We got to go find somebody to raid. Uh, I have too many friends online right now, so we're going to go find a new guy to raid. We're going to go find a new guy doing some art. Um, Miles says, um, the dine pound part is pronounced Dean, like scene, but with a D. Oh, I hate that. Kat says, all jokes aside, no matter what happens, you will still be enjoyable, Wazzy. Thank you. I hope you guys had a good stream. I had a good fucking stream, even though I didn't get any fucking work done. And it's all your guys' fault. Um, hey, this person has a tag of comedy. Fuck yeah, we're going to go to comedy stream. What are you drawing, you little VTuber? Tell me your secrets. Oh, I forgot. Oh, God, I didn't copy it right. Thanks, Twitch, for the unskippable ads. Hey, I hate Twitch unskippable ads. I just want to point that out. Twitch, you fuck you. Uh, anyway, we're going to go, we're going to go get, uh, this V2, oh, they've got rabbit ears, oh, no. Uh, anyway, they're an artist, and they're drawing things, so, um, uh, we're going to go fucking find out what this person's all about, so fucking behave. Don't go in there and tell them all the things you're allergic to, that would be weird, and wouldn't look good on me if you just walked in there and were like, we're allergic to bees, that would be bad. Anyway, crew, we're going to go raid Thank you all for hanging out. I will be back on Sunday with crowd control, um, Resident Evil 4 again, um, or maybe Pokemon. I have to go look at it. Anyway, until next time, don't forget to kick names and take ass. I fucking love and appreciate you guys, but I'll never tell you to your face. Um, and also, fuck you. Fuck you guys. Thank you for all the love and appreciation. I love you guys. Mwah. Go be nice. Okay, bye. Bye. Get out of here. Get out of here.